hello everyone and welcome back to another video and this one is a follow-up to the GTX 770 4GB video I posted recently. In that video the GTX 770 put in respectable performance in 7 out of the 8 games we tested and it was only Doom Eternal that the 770 really struggled with. So in this video I thought it would be interesting to compare the GTX 770 to its old rival the Radeon HD 7970. The GTX 770 has got a higher clock speed and more VRAM, but the 7970 has got a better memory bus and better support for the Vulkan API. Also, the EVGA GTX 770 card I'm using for this test is factory overclocked and faster than a reference card. It's got a maximum boost clock of 1202 MHz instead of the reference card's 1085 MHz boost clock. And in the red corner, the 7970 card I'm using is a reference card. But to even things out a bit, I'm running this card at the same speeds as the later GHz edition. This is easy to do, doesn't require any additional voltage and didn't cause any temperature related issues. So if you've got one of these 7970s I'd recommend that you run at the same settings. It's also worth noting that the Radeon 7970 launched in December 2011, a whole year and a half before the 770, which launched in May 2013. Now when these two originally faced off back in 2013, it was the GTX 770 that typically came out on top. The examples on screen demonstrate this. The 770 wasn't miles ahead of the 7970, but a win still a win, so it'll be interesting to see how these two compare in 2020 playing modern games. Let's find out. <laughs> 